An NL East battle between the Nationals and the Marlins. What kind of a day would Tanner Roark have? Well, let's find out. Here he is on the mound in the fifth inning. Williams out of that game in the fifth inning. Now the pitch in there. Strike three called. Fastball locks up Riddle. Swing and a miss. Taking advantage of his aggressiveness. And suddenly Roark has two K's in a row. Yeah, got the ground ball. Got reordered. Uh, Rewarded, then he strikes out the side. Now the pitch. Defoe swings and lines one deep down the left field line to the corner. Hooking, hooking, it is a fair ball! It hit the foul pole! It is gone, goodbye! It's a home run for Wilmer Defoe! Right down the left field line with his first home run of the year as a right handed hitter. His third home run of the season. with a high drive to deep left. Dietrich back. See you later. The long distant Nats, the leading home run team in the league, on top 2-1. Oh, one ground ball right side off the glove of Bohr. Scoring is Soto. Taylor to third. The Nats lead 3-1. How good is Matt Adams? How good is Mark Reynolds? I'm telling you, these two guys have been doing it. Matt since opening day. Mark Reynolds recently. But he got a chance to hit. He hit the ground ball hard. Maybe Michael A. Taylor ran a little interference there to Justin Bohr, but the redirect. Turner to the gap in right center, and the Nets will lead 4 to 1. Scoring. Is Adams to third is Defoe. Four to one Nationals is your final. Tanner Roark goes seven innings, one run on four hits with five strikeouts. The Nationals have won 17 of their last 23, while the Marlins have lost five of their last seven.